Give Back Friday and today, hey, Tyler Jury, one of the owners of Clayton and Croom and Nulu, joined about 45 others of his employees to pick up trash up and down Market Street. They worked around all of the businesses on that busy stretch, finding cans tucked away in bushes and hauling away trash bags full of trash. And they did it with a great attitude. Look at that, a big smile throwing that can away. <laughs> ben? I tell you what, we are cleaning up this city. That's we got about a year. week to go starting Time to tomorrow. beautify the city. That's right. Looking beautiful out there now after really gloomy conditions pretty much all day today. The clouds have been stubborn and keeping those temperatures down in the 50s and lower 60s. Uh, right now we are at 62 degrees. We are going to have a couple of showers dotting the area from time to time tomorrow afternoon and also for Sunday afternoon. Not going to be a washout and I wouldn't cancel any outdoor plans. Just be ready to maybe head inside briefly if you get caught under one of those showers and keep the umbrella nearby. We will also have a rain chance for Thurby and Oaks, but looking drier so far for Derby. Of course, highly subject to change uh, from now and then, but we'll give you a sneak peek here in the seven day forecast in just a moment. A bunch of weekend events obviously are there on the left side of your screen. Uh, we are the heart of the KD uh, events 71 tomorrow with about a 30% chance of that shower light breezes and then 62 and turning breezier through the day Sunday with about a 30% chance of that shower and that 62 is going to feel cooler than that uh, with those winds picking up our 62 today 11 below our normal high of 73 88 the record back in 18 at 97 and that wind uh, coming in from the west northwest around 10 to 20 humidity at 62 percent and our current temperatures are mixed in the 50s lower 60s only 55 in paoli and the grange right now and hanging out right now in the lower 60s around hodgenville lebanon and springfield at 63 degrees on the pollen report here here today, low levels uh, thanks to that recent rain back up to medium slash high levels of tree and grass pollen for Saturday and Sunday. So not only the trees pollinating, but also grass getting into the mix. Rainfall off to our east. You can see that swirl, that center of low pressure. Dry air is beginning to work in, so a gradual clearing trend for this evening, as we'll see here on Futurecast. So if you are going to be heading out to the balloon glow this evening, temperatures will be in the 50s. Overnight low temps fall down to the 40s. Mainly dry as we get started across the area tomorrow morning with a partly cloudy sky. Good running weather here for the mini and the marathon and light winds for the balloon race. Uh, later in the day, chance for a couple of showers, not going to be a washout. And then as we head into Sunday, as we wrap up this weekend, here comes another little spoke of energy wrapping around an area of low pressure over the Great Lakes that will spark a couple of showers here for our Sunday afternoon. So for the mini and the marathon and the balloon race, temperatures in the 50s tomorrow morning, partly to mostly cloudy. Can't rule out a couple of raindrops out there, but a real, again, really not too bad. Uh, partly cloudy for our Pegasus Parade, upper 50s, lower 60s, uh, but pretty breezy. Winds at around 15 to 30 miles per hour in that chance for a hit or miss shower. Uh, for tonight, to hometown temps clearing out that sky with lows dropping down to the 40s, and tomorrow a mix of 60s and lower 70s with that isolated shower chance. Uh, May starts off more like March on Monday with temperatures in the 50s and breezy conditions Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday, but dry. And we do have to introduce a few more rain chances there for Oaks and for Thurby, but at least it will be milder in the lower 70s.